Welcome back to Vandersville Plays. We have a treat for you today. All right, everybody pays attention. No one gets hurt. Go! Open the door! They'll get worse than hurt! Hey! Hey! This is Grand Theft Auto V. We're going to play the whole thing from first-person mode. Um, I am very versed in... Come on, Nestor. We're giving you everything you want. I don't even think about it. In this game. However... Uh, the new first-person mode adds enough. I'll handle the plastic. Don't blow yourself up. Pay attention. Here, get the fuck in there. Uh, to to me, adds enough unfamiliarity that I feel it's okay to go ahead and play it on the show. I am gonna let you guys know though that this isn't technically a blind run. I have gotten every possible single-player achievement in the game, uh, which I must point out because I am a self-centered, egotistical bastard, and I'm very familiar. Well, at least one time through familiar with this, with the story. <sighs> However, they've got this going and I figured people might want to see it. So this is how the game starts. And also, also, I just played through this. I just played through the first 10 minutes. Went back and checked my footage. Microphone wasn't recording. So if I seem a little familiar with the first person controls, I've been playing with them for about 10 minutes now. Um, you should have seen the first time I tried to drive, I was looking out the windows and crashed into a train post. I wish... I wish I could show that footage. I saw your face, I remember you. You get a thousand things every day. How about you make sure this is one of them? I've seen his eyes! He's crazy! Oh, it's crazy! I think. Be cool. It'll be quick. Fuck out of here. Get off my buddy. Let's get going. There'll be time for grieving later. Yeah, you got that right. Move. Reload that one bullet, because that's how reloading works, right? Uh, you'll see a lot of idiots think that just because it's not how reloading works in real life means you shouldn't reload when you're running around missing a few bullets. Um, I believe this is an excuse for either A, forgetting to fucking reload all the time, or B, just pure laziness. Obviously, if the game lets you reload, fucking reload. Come on, guys! Get out of the way or so. When you zoom in now, it does that. But if you and so if you don't, it's easier to get headshots. But obviously, zooming in gives you a better view. So you gotta decide between trying to play like that or easy headshots. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. I want to make it very clear that I have nothing against cops. Obviously, there are asshole cops and people trying to pretend that there aren't are stupid. And you could even argue that the whole idea of authority does attract, does call two bad people. Um, however, the problem is not cops, the problem is humanity. People are fucking horrible. And cops are people. Therefore, you will have some horrible cops. Anyway, this is just Grand Theft Auto. If you're stupid enough to think that this somehow represents actual feelings towards cops, well, die in fire. Fuck out of here. This is not good cover. Let's go. Get to the car. Can't help but notice that you are still alive. Health is low. I should probably be playing safer than I am. I just want to get back through this since I already recorded it once. Get in here. We'll get in. Give me a fucking minute. Shut the fuck up. What took you so long? 
Well, this is going much faster than the first time. Good. The good news is I know what caused the issue and it shouldn't happen again. I apologize, I'm talking over a lot of dialogue, I'm not trying to. <laughs> Did we ever even get that guy's name? Oh, we're up to the wrong button. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> What's up, cops? What's up, cops? Can I still... Oh, yeah? That's what it looks like when you look behind you. Okay. That's not... <laughs> it's not very helpful look behind you. What am I... St oh, no. Come on. Don't be stuck. Ooh, this whole first-person thing is crazy. So it's Michael's fault all this happened. Where the fuck's the chopper? Fuck. Oh, we act. Oh, it's the feds. Okay, I thought we got betrayed, actually. Why would you just sit there when someone gets sniped, Michael? What the fuck? T, you gotta get out of here. I'm gonna leave you, Mikey. Go. God, I'm not gonna be fucking gonna bleed out. No. So we're Fuck making good time. This is where oh, I had to end it last time. Mine, mine, mine rampage. You know, look how many bullets I got. We're gonna. Kill me, you pricks! Come on! We're gonna blow up your cars, actually. Is this car invincible? Oh, all right, well. And we're loading, loading, loading at the scene. Was not always a good husband. Not always a good citizen. He did not die a hero's death. But he was a man. Our Lord was crucified for two reasons. So perhaps he did not judge. I'm glad it didn't end there. It's a better ending. But we know that you will show mercy to our friends. Late title screen. It should be a fun ride. I'm going to enjoy this. Your son, James. He's a good kid. He's a good kid? A, a good kid. Why? Does he help the fucking poor? No. He sits on his ass all day, smoking dope and jerking off while he plays that fucking game. If that's our standard for goodness, then no wonder this country's screwed. And what about you? What about me? 
I love this guy. I don't have the advantages that kid has. By the time I was his age, I'd already been in prison twice. I robbed banks. I ran whores, smuggled dope. And you consider them achievements? These were the opportunities I had. At least I took them. And where did these opportunities get you, Michael? They got me right fucking here. The end of the road. With a big house and a useless kid, and I'm stuck talking to you because no one else gives a shit. Oh, I'm living a dream, baby. And that dream <laughs> is fucked. It is fucking fucked. Let it all out. I think I just did. <sighs> oh. Well, I think that's all we have time for. The same time next week? I guess. I gotta tell you, I ain't too sure this shit is working for me. Hmm. Well, a sense of overriding futility is a vital part of the process. Embrace it. Whatever you say, Doc. Embrace the fut futility. It's gonna go on for a little bit, so I'm gonna let this play out. Get the intro out of the way. I almost, I, I, I want to, I, I almost got the PC version, but I could play the PC version and make it look probably quite a lot better than this. But to record it while playing, a recording takes up a lot of resources. It would probably end up looking worse than this. So that's why we are on the Expo. Gotta be around here somewhere. Unless they buried it under the sand, fool. Another Bray and Lamar Davis production. Man, fuck you. Hey, excuse me, homie. Can you tell me where Berto Beach House is? No, homie, I cannot. Man, won't you come on? Fuck. Actually, yeah. It's that house right there, with the yellow stairs. Yeah. Good looking out, homie. Appreciate it. Man, get your stupid ass on. Damn. Why don't you ask him if he knows the fucking owner? Or better yet, do some skywriting and reads there's a couple niggas here about to boost some cars in case somebody didn't realize. See, what you don't realize is we ain't boosting. This shit is legit business. Legit? Oh yeah, I forgot, huh? 401ks, tax returns and all. Yeah, right. You the one all pumped up on doing this lick, nigga. I'm getting my money in the hood. I'm straight, fool. I'm cool. You cool? Cool what? Slanging dope and throwing up gang signs? Yeah, right. Whatever, homie. Yeah, homie, this the spin knot right here. Your boy Simeon wasn't bullshit. Man, get your ass in here. Bring your ass, fool. You're always trying to boss somebody. Come on. Come on. All right, we will stop it here. I apologize for the lack of commentary there in the end, but, you know, we're here for the game anyway. Um, I'm going to, I try really hard to never talk over cutscenes that have dialogue going on. Or even cutscenes that are integral to the plot. So, we'll see you guys next time. I'm going to go see if my audio recorded this time.